Hello everybody! Um, I just wanted to make a super quick video um, demonstrating something that has been super useful to me as I've been putting some Google slideshows together. So let me show you the problem. If I go over to this little spaceship picture, I'm going to go copy image, paste it in my slideshow. As you can see, it has a white background. This happens a lot when you're using clip art from Google image searches. Now, uh, I've seen a lot of methods to do this that involve downloading the picture, then putting it into some background removing website, and then downloading that picture and loading it in. But that takes too long and it's really, really clunky. So uh, I wanted to find a faster way of doing it and I found one. It's going to involve using uh, whatever software you have on your computer. If you're on uh, Windows, it's probably going to be PowerPoint if you have that. I'm using a Mac which comes with Keynote, so that's what I'm going to use. Uh, Alright, so we need to delete that background, get rid of that picture. I'm going to go back to my source, again just make sure I have the image copied. Before I do anything with slides, I'm just going to go to Keynote, I put a triangle here for uh, demonstration, you'll see. I'm going to paste this image, Command V, or just, you know, paste into Keynote, and you can see it's covering up that triangle. What we can do in Keynote and, and PowerPoint, that just the button is located in a different spot, we're going to go to Format. Uh, instant alpha, it might be called remove background, so we're going to click that, and then it lets me choose however much I want of the image to choose a color. We can see that the background is turning light blue when I let go, boom, background is gone, I click done, and then I can just copy, go back to my slideshow, and paste, and take a look at that. No more background. So I hope you found that helpful. Again, if you don't have a Keynote or a PowerPoint, you may have to use another software uh, to do it. You may have to do the upload download thing. But if you're working on a Mac anyway, you have Keynote. So I wanted to show you that. It saved me a lot of time uh, in putting PowerPoints together. Let me know if you found this helpful uh, and I will see you next time.